Okay, today topic it is side chemical shift factors. Before going to start this section, NMR spectroscopy section, I want to say that hi, good morning everyone. First factor is that inductive effect. Inductive effect says that atom, if given atom is placed in that uniform magnetic field, is that the nucleus is surrounded by that uh, electrons. This is that nucleus given, surrounded by that electrons given. And this is causes to produce that a secondary field. It is opposed to that applied field of the other nucleus. This is the other nucleus. That causes is a shielding. This is a shielding of the nucleus. The electron density is around the atom. It is reduced due to that negative inductive effect. If the neighboring electronegative atoms is a secondary field, it decreases. As a result, the resonance will be now occur down field. That's why high delta value is given. Now we have to focus on that revision part easy way to that. This is atom uniform magnetic field given. This nucleus is surrounded and to produce a secondary field. Secondary field is right opposite to that applied field to other nucleus. And that causes of that a shielding effect of that nucleus. However, electron density point come. Electron density is now. It is that reduce that negative inductive effect. Okay, neighboring electronegative atoms given not to produce that a secondary field, it is decreases. As a result, is that resonance effect is decreased. That's why down field is a high delta value will be shown. Here to second uh, effect, it is a factor, it is that resonance effect. What are the points we have to cover of that? This section it is that this factor is that chemical shift is denoted as delta. First point it is it is in the presence of this effect will be presence of that two points we have to show that one electron donating and withdrawing groups in the presence of that aromatic ring system or benzene given and this is first we have to discuss that electron donating groups electron donating group means it is that positive inductive effect or positive resonance effect it is a shielding of that protons this are around that aromatic system and next we said a force is that a force of resonance in the high force of resonance that's why it's a low delta value now we have to come to that second point it is a electron donating withdrawing groups withdrawing group means it is a negative inductive effect negative resonance effect will be show it means shielding of the protons of aromatic system is that a uh, down field this resonance in down field given that side is that low delta value this is that high delta value low down field means it is a high delta value okay electron donating and withdrawing group just revision part of resonance effect it depended upon electron donating groups means i and r effect positive and withdrawing means de dependent upon that negative i and negative r effect this is how this one is that electron donating group show that high delta value is given resonance effect high resonance field given that's why it is that low delta value low chemical shift and next one is that electron withdrawing groups given no this is low resonance effect it depend on negative or uh, negative r negative i effect this is everything will be depend upon that aromatic system aromatic benzene thing system okay simple example given it is that chemical shift values benzene is that 7.24 and not group attached in upper ortho position we can see it is 8.24 and next it is that a ch double bond o is a 7.85 and co ch3 k1 this is a 7.98 co nh2 k1 is 7.89 this is a chemical shift range given chlorine is given 7.28 and this is bromine 7.46 iodine is 7.66 and CH3 group given in ortho position 7.111 and that OH position attached in that ortho position 6.78 and next is OCH3 means 6.81 OCOR given is a 7.07 and NH3 is at 6.5 start with 8 end with that 6 okay easy way to understand that in meta position we have to decrease that in size has to compare to ortho position and meta is decrease and para position is that uh, meta increase to that meta position increase that value in meta position vision is a term first ortho position is greater next para position and next meta position here the third factor it is we are discussing that proton is that hydrogen bonded it causes that a uh, down field shift relate to that unbonded state for example a permanganate is a shift is associated with that hydrogen bonding and hydrogen bonded of proton of phenol and carboxylic acid appear that delta value is greater than the negative delta value shows that greater has to compare to that uh, delta value is greater than that 10 and negative tau value will be show and if the chemical shift affect that deshielded effect of that protons 
Here the first point it is that a uh, carbonyl groups under that uh, anisotropic effect and one row all is that the shielded effect. A few generalization and relation between that molecular structures and chemical shift. Here the sum of that this box given is put on that nitrogen, oxygen, halogen groups. These are that electronegative atoms. These are de-shielded protons. Increase that chemical shift value. And this one is that is a greater electronegative atoms. Okay, next point we have to come to that a pi electrons given. Pi electrons we have to focus on alkynes. Alkynes means it is a carbon to carbon triple bonds and it is the carbonyl groups and alkenes. Alkenes means it is a carbon to carbon double bond. It is our these are our LT shaded protons. It's an increasing order of that chemical shift values range given. So carbonyl groups is right carbonyl. Next it is alkyl groups and next it is that vinyl groups and next it is that alkenyl groups given. Okay, increasing the range of that T-shaded protons given is that alkenyl groups given is a carbon to carbon triple bond. It is a very low T-shaded protons as to compare carbonyl or aryl groups or vinyl groups. Okay, in see it is other. Uh, if the direction given, it is that which one is that increasing order carbonyl. Next it is an aryl group. This is aryl group. And next is alkenyl and vinyl. Okay, alkyl groups given is that three alkyl groups. It is that increasing order of that chemical shift range given. This is the first one is the increasing range given is that chemical shift. And next we have to focus on that uh, delta value is increasing. Okay, delta means it is a chemical shift. Tetramethylene, it is a shielded proton. It is a electropositive atoms. Okay, this uh, chemical shift value is given is that delta is equal to zero. And next we have to see that in a it is a pi electron system is an aromatic. This is shielded protons. This is a shielded protons given now that is that uh, electronegative atom is that even electronegative atom is a uh, negative electro atom is a chemical shift value is given negative. And even negative chemical shift value we have to show that. Okay, next we have to see that it is a carbonyl group given. Uh, this is the carbonyl groups, it's attached to the carbon atoms, it's the electron withdrawing groups and de-shaded protons and de-shaded protons even at that electropositive adjacent carbon atoms. Electron density is given, what does it uh, meaning? Electron density have to be classified into two types, one is the electron rich and that electron poor. In the decrease surrounded by the electron rich, what happens? It is a lower magnetic field will be show and this magnetic field is a low resonance frequency have to show that it is a shielded proton. And uh, what is a local means? It is a low resonant frequency means we can say it is at uh, upfield shift. We can say higher the uh, chemical shift will be had to show. And next we have to come to the electron pore. If the electron nucleus is surrounded by the pore electrons. It is de-shielded and the magnetic. This is a higher resonance frequency just because of that uh, a lower uh, chemical shift we have to show. Lower chemical shift means it is a downfield. We can also say it is downfield.